Hey y'all, we're gonna give you the truth about fat. And how does it work? How do you burn fat off your body? Um, this is really cool. A lot of people don't realize this is that you actually breathe it out. You actually can sweat it out. You actually can pee it out. How does that all work? Well, it's really neat because when fat gets metabolized through the liver, it actually breaks down in just different forms of energy, but your body has to get rid of it all, right? And so this is important because why exercise matters, hydration matters, and, and moving your body and staying low carb matters. It sets you up for burning fat efficiently. And so you really want to be able to do this in the most effective way. Now, because of people's health and metabolic challenges, people are not burning fat efficiently. So this is where it gets a little op uh, com complicated, a little bit hard, why people may not be getting results as fast, or maybe people are, are plateauing more, and you want to make some simple adjustments. So first thing you want to do is you want to, you want to make sure you sweat. How do you sweat? Go out and move your body. Second thing you want to be able to do is you want to get your carbs down a little bit lower. So fat will burn faster when carbs are less present because your body can use glucose for energy and it can use body fat for energy, right? And so we want to we want to tap into the fat stores more. You do that by dropping your glucose by eating less carbs and sugars. Now there is a secret weapon out there, of course, drinking ketones uh, makes this whole process even faster and more efficient and easier. But you want to drop those carbs, move your body, of course, and go pee, go sweat, go move, go breathe more. And so these are things that are going to help you burn fat and, and help your fat get released out of your body. And then, of course, as you elevate your ketone levels, you elevate your life. And you get all the other benefits, the signaling benefits. You get the cognition, the mood, the focus, the vitality. Because ketones provide these amazing, amazing energy to your body, and but it has all these other long-term benefits of optimizing health. Now, keep in mind, we don't have that much storage for glucose. It's it's a you know the larger you are as a person, the more you can store in your muscles. Um, your liver can store glucose, and then your blood has glucose in it. So you don't have a lot of storage unit. It's kind of like trying to store. Uh, think of it if you're a car, right? And you're basically filling up your gas tank. And you only have a certain amount of room. You have 25 gallon or a 15 gallon tank or whatever it is. And then if you overfill it, instead of the gas spilling out on the floor, what happens is actually the gas goes in and, and attaches itself to the car as padding. And what, <laughs> and what happens is that if you keep filling up the gas tank with glucose, it can't tap into the storage around the car and the car keeps growing to the point where it can't even drive down the road very well. It can't move very well. It can't get in the garage anymore. So you have to get a bigger garage, bigger clothes, right? You have to get a bigger house. And then the goal is, is that you don't want to keep filling up the gas tank. What you want to do is tap into the stored fuel, the, 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 the tissue around the car and start burning that off right? Well, what's the best way to do that is to start driving your car across country, start doing little, little speed races, quarter mile races. That's exercise. So start moving your body. And what's going to happen is going to have more, more motion moving forward. You're going to drink a lot of water. Remember, hydration is really, uh, really important with good electrolytes because you want to be able to have good flushing, peeing out. You want to sweat more because you can sweat out some of that excess. You want to breathe more and you get that by moving your body. So Drink your ketones daily, y'all, but the truth about burning body fat is really about eating less carbohydrates, drinking ketones, and move your body. That's the, that's the simplest answer. Now, if you're not dropping, if you get plateaued, there's a many reasons why you might be doing that. Good chances are your carbs are too high, your calories are too high, your, your, uh, your ketone levels aren't elevating, so drink more ketones, and you're not moving your body enough. So those are the simple, simple answers. There's some always some other variables in there, but that's the general ones. Bye, y'all.